Hi artists, for this project we're going to build upon our previous lesson and learn about symmetry. You're going to want to start by using a computer piece of paper or a notebook piece of paper and we're going to fold it directly in half. This way we can divide our paper by having a line of symmetry. For this project we are going to be drawing insects. So you can choose any insect you would like but we're going to practice that by drawing it with a line of symmetry. Since we have our paper folded in half, you want to make sure that you are drawing on the side of the paper that has a fold. Now as a reminder, we are learning about symmetry, so for this part of our project, you're only going to want to draw half of your insect. The second half we will finish as soon as we draw the first. So whichever insect you'd like to use, and then you're going to draw all the details on one side before opening your paper. For this project, I decided to draw a dragonfly. I needed to add a lot of little details within the wings to show the different textures that the dragonfly has. This is also going to be shown as a very difficult part to redraw on the opposite side when I'm practicing my line of symmetry. Once you have finished drawing half of your insect, you're going to unfold your paper and begin to draw the other side. Your goal for this project is creating an insect that is completely symmetrical. Like noted earlier, the wings was a very difficult spot to create symmetrically. I started following with my finger and trying to replicate that texture on my new side of paper. Once you have finished drawing the opposite side of your insect, go ahead and begin coloring. Make sure that your entire insect is colored in, including the background. For this project, you can use any coloring material that you have at home.
this project, you are going to turn in two photographs of your art. The first photograph of your art is going to be taken with only one side of your image drawn. Your second image that you submit to me on Google Classroom will be shown as the full insect drawing completely colored. Because this video does not show me completing the project, I have added my project example at the end of this video. Make sure that your entire insect is colored in and the background is colored as well. I look forward to seeing your artwork. Have fun! Music